Hey everyone, so this is a video about a bit of code that Alan Massey off of the Inventable Forum uh, made to help you find X, Y, and Z zero all at the same time, well not at the same time, but all automatically and uh, it's pretty neat so I wanted to make a video about it. This is the edge finder that I'm using. It's called the Triple Edge Finder. It's made by the Maker's Guide and I had to modify the code to work with this but this will sit right up on your workpiece and find the edge right there in the center of the circle would be the edge of your workpiece and you'll see the bit come over here and it'll touch here and then that'll set your X and then it'll come over here and touch this I'll set your Y and then I'll move up and over and it'll touch here and that'll set your Z axis and it'll do that all automatically for you so you find the very edge or corner of your workpiece every single time same so we'll load up Mach 3 and go into the machine and show you how it works okay so I have an Xbox controller on my machine and first thing we'll do is we'll set our edge finder on the material and then we'll jog the machine over to our edge finder And the way I modified the code is I set it so it's going down on the edge right there. Okay, and then we'll attach our other lead to or call it. So now the machine's set up and we're ready to run the code. So we'll go over to Mach 3 and we'll hit the Auto Zero Tool button and it'll tell us we need to touch the, the probe to the end of the bit. So this our we'll touch it, put that back, and then it'll come with a block that says zero Z only, yes or no. But well, we want to zero all of them. So We'll delete the Y, put in an N, push OK. Then it asks the diameter of our bit. And that is a quarter inch bit. So we'll delete the one. So it's 0.25. Okay. Then we'll push OK or push Enter, no matter. And we'll let it run. Now it's moving in. Touch the X, moved over, over. You know, move slowly in. Now touch the Y. Then it moves up. Now it's moving. I have mine set real slow, just for when I was playing with it. You can speed this up. Now it'll come down. I'll touch the Z. Now you're all set. And as you can see, we'll remove the edge finder. And we want to line up with this corner right here. So we'll go over here and we'll push go to zero. And you'll see that it'll line up right on the edge. Right on the edge. every time in the X, Y, and Z position. Um, don't matter, we can, we can move it all around. Then we got it over there. I just pushed 
go to zero. Now go right back. So the code, there'll be links to where you can get it from me and Alan, the my modified version, and then Alan's original version in the description box below. Thanks.